Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, the Dokkan Battle Jump Festa panel happened recently, and it actually revealed some pretty interesting stuff about the next celebration that's coming to the JP side of the game, which is starting in about 4-5 to five days from now, and that would be the end of year slash new year celebration. So, what you see on the screen right now is the uh, campaign banner slash campaign image, and the big reveal from this panel was related to the upcoming New Year's Dual Dokkan Fest, which will feature a brand new Super Saiyan Goku and a new Kid Buu. So there you go guys, no more need for speculation, no more need for predictions. We now know that this year's New Year's Dual Dokkan Fest is Goku and Kid Buu. Now, in this picture, they only showed us the SSR forms of these units, so we don't know exactly what they'll look like after their Dokkan Awakenings. So I'm assuming that Goku will go Super Saiyan 3 at some point, or maybe through like an active skill. Although, a Spirit Bomb attack active skill would make more sense for the Goku, right? So uh, I'm thinking he stays Super Saiyan after he Dokkan Awakens and then he transforms into Super Saiyan 3 just automatically after some condition is fulfilled, maybe when you're below a certain amount of HP or after a certain amount of turns, and then the active skill is the Spirit Bomb attack. And then Kid Buu will stay Kid Buu, but I'm sure he also has a uh, active skill attack as well. So there you go guys, that is the Dual Dokkan Fest. I've seen a little bit of outrage, just a tiny bit, in the uh, community about the Kid Buu being a TUR as opposed to an LR because obviously Kid Buu seems like a character that deserves an LR at this point, right? And now we're finally getting a new Kid Buu after I don't know how many years. When was the last Kid Buu released? Uh, was it... Is Kid Buu? Am I forgetting another unit or was Fizz Kid Buu literally the last Kid Buu released. Yeah, it's been a while since we got a new Kid Buu, and now we're getting one, and I'm sure he's gonna be great. I'm sure both the Goku and the Kid Buu will be really, really powerful, but yeah, I understand some of the, I don't know, outrage or just some people being a little bit salty that it's not an LR Kid Buu. I get it, but to be honest, I don't mind it too much. <laughs> I mean, these days, a lot of TURs are just as good as LRs. I don't think the rarity really matters that much anymore or has any bearing on how good a unit is. Um, you can argue that there are some TURs that are much better than 99% of the LRs out there. So I really don't think it matters if Kid Buu is an LR or not. Although, it'd be nice to eventually get one. Um, these ones will be TURs, like the Super Saiyan Goku and the Kid Buu. And that is totally fine. Now, at this point, we have no information about what they do. We don't know what their passives are, what their leader skills are, all that good stuff. If you guys want to, you know, leave some predictions in the comments, feel free to go ahead and do so. But uh, that's it, guys. That's basically what we learned from this panel. Of course, it was pretty big because the Dual Dokkan Fest is, you know, important. But uh, I do wish they gave us a little bit more to go on, you know, like maybe at least their leader skills or maybe like a preview of the animations or something like that, but I guess it's fine. Now, uh, of course, there are other things happening for the New Year celebration on both sides of the game that they haven't revealed yet, like the uh, New Year Step Up banner, which is definitely happening. You guys don't need to, you know, worry about that because it's been going on for multiple years now. It's kind of a tradition, so it's definitely going to happen. You know, the guaranteed LR banner with, uh, you know, three rounds or maybe four rounds this year. Who knows? And uh, yeah, I guess that's all there really is to talk about. As I said, there's no other details about these units. So all we can really do right now is speculate about what they do. But I'm sure they're both going to be really, really good, regardless of the fact that they are not LRs and their TURs, I really don't think it matters at all. But uh, feel free to let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about these characters. Do you think that another Super Saiyan Goku is just too much? Because 
there are a lot of Super Saiyan Gokus in the game, right? And uh, as far as the Kid Buu goes, I'm very happy we're getting a new Kid Buu. Maybe it'd be better if he was an LR, but as long as he's good, like who really cares, right? So uh, there you go, guys. That is the video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Video. Signing out.